Hello everybody and welcome back to more Let's Play Final Fantasy 7. In the last episode, we did some, uh, this Final Fantasy 7 blind, I keep forgetting to mention that. Welcome to more stuff. In the last episode, in the last episode, we fought off some police and we jumped on top of a train. In this episode, we are inside of said train. Um, I feel like I'm supposed to do something here to progress the plot forward, but I don't know what that something is. I can't sit down. I've already talked to everybody. There we go. I know how you feel about the whole sleep thing, man. Alright, so... Lines in the Sherry Town of the Terrace that bomb the number one reactor are based somewhere in the slums, etc, etc, yep. Mm. Yeah, don't bother the other passengers, please! Yeah, because us dirty, homely, slovenly people can't be with the normal people because we... Yeah. Also, did anyone else notice that Cloud's arms kind of look like markers? Or maybe like spatulas or something? And he's just like, mm. he's just like, Ugh, I got spatula arms. I'm not happy about this. Anyway, seriously, what, what, what am I supposed to do? Shut- you shut up! Uh-huh! Sure, kid! Okay. I feel like I'm- I really feel like I'm missing something here. Where is Thing? Can I has Thing? Can't go back there. Can I stand on this? No. Jeez, man, this is just... This is... Oh. Do I, do I really just have to wait for the train to get there? Stop acting like I can sit down and shut up. Yeah, I would love to sit down, but I can't seem to do that anywhere. No, I don't want to talk to you again. Yeah, sit down. Sit down, Cloud. Uh, okay, I've been playing the game for like a serious hour. Why am I getting stuck on this? Sit down and shut up. I got you. Thanks. Hmm. It's, uh... It's a strange. Barret, I'm getting sick of you. Ah, oh, holy crap. Why can I not just sit down? Why can I not advance the plot? Yeah. Oh, well, the other passengers. Eh, yeah, you're too dirty and stupid looking. You have spatula arms. Or markers. I don't know. Seriously, they look like felt tip markers. Dude. Do I just need to talk to everybody? Like, multiple times? Yeah, okay, cool, yeah, sure, whatever. Thanks, bro. Stop it. Uh, okay. Alright, so I've talked to everybody. I'd like to, I'd like to talk to... You. No, not you. Not you. You. Hey, Cloud, want to look at this with me? It's a map of Midgar Rail System. Let's look at it together. I'll explain it to you. I like this kind of stuff. Bombs and monitors. You know, flashy things. Okay. It's about to start. Sit down and watch the movie. We need some popcorn. It's a complete model of the city of Midgar. It's about 1 to 10,000 scale. It's also on a screen. Top plate is about 50 meters above ground. Main pillar supports the plate at the center. There are other support pillars, etc., etc., built into each station. Psst, whisper, whisper. Number one reactor we blew up was in the northern section. 
obviously. Then there's number two, number three, all the way up to reactor number eight. The eight reactors provide Midgar with electrics. East Town used to have a name, but no one in Midgar remembers them. Instead of names, we just refer to them by number and sectors. That's how things turn out. Well, that sucks. Look, what's next? It's the exact same image. Oh, here it is now. This is the route the train is on. The route spirals around the main pillar. We should be coming around the center right now. Each checkpoint has an ID sensor. Oh, no. It's linked up to the central data bank at Shira headquarters. Okay, well, it looks like we're kind of... Yeah, we definitely look suspicious, so we're using fake IDs, obviously. Oh, no! Speak of the devil. The light means that we're in this security... Okay, well, that's really loud, flashy, and scary. When the lights go off, we never know what kind of creeper will come out. We're almost back now, so put a relief. This whole game is very text-heavy, isn't it? I know! Next time I'll just make- I'll make one just for you! Looking forward to it. Put a little extra effort in and make it with a bang. Alright, sweet. So can I sit down now? You can see the surface now. This city- This city don't have a day or night? That's- Wow! If the plate weren't there, we could see the sky. A floating city, pretty unsettling scenery. Never expect to hear that of uh, someone like you. You're just full surprise. No, well, well, I mean, yeah. What do you expect from someone with felt tip markers for hands? The upper world, a city on a plate. Because of that pizza, that people underneath are suffering. The city below is full of polluted air. Sounds like just like New York. On top of that, the reactor keeps draining all the energy. Why doesn't everyone just move onto the plate? You know, probably because they ain't got no money. Socioeconomic disparity. What? He hasn't got enough bolts. I know, no one lives in the slums because they want to. It's like this train. Can't run anywhere except where its rails take it. Wow, what a good euphemism for life. Cutscenes! Also, something I forgot to mention in previous parts that I really should mention. I'm not going for 100% here. I'm just going to... F you know, I just want to finish the game. See the end credits. The final boss, etc, etc. All that... All that good stuff. Alright, Mr. Barrett, how are you doing? What's up? What's the battle plan? What's the strategy, Captain? This mission was a success, but we don't need to get lazy now. The hard part's still to come. Don't y'all be scared of that explosion. As you all know, cool guys don't walk... Cool guys walk away from explosions. Walk away in slow motion. Meet back in the hideout. Move out! Alright, so where are we now? To the hideout! Yay! We can't let anyone know how super secret the super secret hideout is. What's this way, though? Ooh, a save point. Okay. Hey, what's up there, buddy? Taking a whiz? How's it going? Eh! Yeah. What on earth are you doing? Just butt out. Jeez. Came to see it, too. There was a bombing on top of this pillar came down. Everyone in the slums is dust. There's no point in worrying about that. Hey, check it out. It's huge, ain't it? Oh, ho, ho, ho. Yeah. Look at that. That's a thing. Some tells me at some point in this game, I'm going to have to climb to the top of that and blow it up. That's a big pillar. Oh, yawning. 
strange and wonderful place. It's my place, but you can come see it whenever you want. See you, bro. Okay. Yo, cloud over here now. Okay, fine. Dude, I, I am over here. Stop it. This is the secret hideout. Wait, what? Why are we clearing them all out of a tavern? It's not a very secretive hideout if we just kick everyone out of a tavern. Little, little baby. Don't act like you don't know what I mean. I'm telling you. Fine, I'll just jump over this like everyone else does. Can I not jump? Jeez. Alright, fine. To the tavern! Papa! Uh... Okay, so that's Tifa. Aren't you gonna say anything to Cloud? Welcome home, Cloud. Looks like everything went well. Did you fight with Barrett? Yeah. I should have known. He's always pushing people around. You've always been in fights ever since you were little. I was worried. Yeah. Sounds good. Flowers? How nice. You almost never see them here in the slums. But, a flower for me? Oh, Cloud, you shouldn't have. Thanks, Cloud. It smells wonderful. Oh my gosh. Oh my god, I love flowers. Oh. Okay, so is Tifa like my sister or my love interest? Or I don't I don't get it. <laughs> oh Cloud, Tifa really knows how to cook. Mmm, let me tell you something. About what? Tifa always lets me taste her cooking. Look at me now, I'm roly-poly. I don't know whether I should be happy or sad, but it's good food and drinks that make this shop famous. Ah, nothing like that first drink after a job. Yeah. That one too? Nah, no thanks. Tell me you're too good for a drink with me. I don't like big headed just because you're a soldier. No, I'm, no, see, you, you realize alcohol, I have enough alcohol in the tips of my marker hands, so if I put more in, it's just, it's gonna be real bad. Hey, Wedge, you're getting all excited. Stop making such a mess. So that's your name, Wedge. Alright. Hello, little girl. Talk to me, little girl. Talk to me! Alright, fine. So, what do I do here? Marlene's a little shy. Well, yeah, I bet she is. Can I place the pinball? Ugh, pinball. Alright, fine. You know what? Okay, guess I gotta. Do I go talk to. Okay! Papa, welcome home! Okay, so that's that's his daughter. Alright, that makes sense. You alright, Barrett? Great! Ah, get in here, fools. We're starting the meeting. Don't you worry, girl. I'll come back for you. Alright. So anyway. We're going down to the ground. There's so many places. Okay. About to say, what's with the little gunshots, but... Yeah, yo, Cloud, there's something I want to ask you. Was there anyone from Soldier fighting us today? Uh, well, I had to... No, oh, there were some soldiers. Well, you sound pretty sure. <laughs> if there was anyone from Soldier, I wouldn't be standing here right now. Don't go think. Don't go thinking you're so bad just because you was in Soldier. Why are you? Don't don't hit your daughter. You're making her sad. Whoa. Okay. Yeah, you're strong. Probably all them guys in Soldiers are. Don't forget you're. I didn't realize this was an M-rated game. You asked me a question, I answered it, that's all. So get off my case, pal, or I'm gonna snuff you out with my marker hands. Alright, so anyway. Whoa! Wait, Cloud! Tifa, let him go. 
Looks like he's, he still misses the Shinra. Shut up! I don't care about Shinra North Soldier! <laughs> Mommy's picking on me again. Don't get me wrong, I don't care about the avalanche or the planet for that matter. I just don't care about nothing. <laughs> Alright. Except for you, Tifa. Straighten things up with everyone. Okay. Money! Oh my. It must have been for a lot of it. Well, what the hell. It's a verbal agreement. Now let me figure this out. Oh, stop it, Cloud. Did you hear me? Alright. Uh, I'm sorry that you are in distress. Cloud, you'd say you don't care, but you came to talk to me. Cloud, you just want friends. Isn't that right? Blow, <laughs> blow off. I really don't care. Why don't I have a nice option? You're terrible, real cold-blooded. Yeah, I'm a, I'm a serial killer. With marker hands, okay. Okay, so that's a thing. Uh. Oh, Papa, you're so great. Uh. Being the number one reactor was bombed. The terrorist group Avalanche has claimed responsibility for the bombing. It is expected that Avalanche will continue its reign of terror. The citizens of Midgar, there is no need to fear. I have immediately mobilized soldiers to protect our citizenry against the sentinels of violence. Thank you, good night. So you're telling me that we're, we're the bad guys? Yeah, we're the bad guys. We're terrorists. No. Blow off. I like the music, though. It's real common. I want to go talk to the dead guy over here that got that got his crap punched. Shucks, money. Shucks, money. Okay. Uh, is he all right? He doesn't look so good. Papa, you're so great. Straighten things up with everyone for me. I did though. I'm trying to talk to people, but it's not doing nothing. Fine. Let's go back up. I don't understand really what I'm supposed to be doing. Oh, oh hell, this is some Mountain Dew. Listen, Cloud, I'm asking you, please join us. No, I'm sorry, Tifa, but I can't do it. You see, it all started back in the war. The planet is dying, slowly but surely it's dying. Someone has to do something. Again, just like America. So let Barrett and his buddies do something about it. It's got nothing to do with me. So you're really leaving? You can't just leave and walk out ignoring your childhood friend. Yep, love interest. How can you say that? Sorry. You forgot the promise, too. Oh, swoon. What's the promise? So you did forget. This whole this is reminding me of Xenoblade so much. Remember, Cloud, it was seven years ago. It all started seven years ago. Years ago, years ago. Flashback. Oh, look, it is the well. Do you remember? Yeah, back then. Thought you were never coming. It was getting a bit cold. <sighs> And I'm just sitting on sitting on the dock of the bay, watching the tides roll away. Sorry, I'm late. Is this a, is this a date, huh? Ah, uh, Tifa, you might wanna you, you might need to see a doctor. Your knees look a little disconnected. You said you wanna talk to me about something. Come this spring, I'm leaving town for Midgar. For <laughs> Midgar, all the boys are leaving town. I wish the boys were back in town, but I'm different from them. I'm not just going to find a job. Nice, uh, cool ponytail you got. I want to join soldier. I want to be a policeman. I'm going to be the best policeman there is, just like Sephiroth. Uh, okay, I don't know much about Final Fantasy, but I know that he's a bad guy.
Isn't it hard to join soldier? Yeah, oh, they don't just let in anybody. Probably won't be able to come back to this town for a while. Love how they refer to it as this town. Instead of, oh, I don't know, a name. If you make it, will you be in Danuth, Poopert? I'll try. Let's make a promise. I promise with all my heart, cross my heart, and hope to die. If you ever get really famous and I'm ever in a bind, you'll come save me, right? What? If I'm ever in trouble with my hero, oh, 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 oh be still my heart. <laughs> oh, that's, that's so nice. Yes, I, no, Cl Cloud, don't be a douche. Not a hero and I'm not famous. But you got our childhood dream, didn't you? You joined Soldier, and then I quit. <laughs> so come on, you gotta keep your promise. How do you want me to save you right now? Okay, dude, you could've just used the pinball machine. A promise is a promise. Oh, sweet, I got my monies. 1,500 gil? Awesome! This is my pay, don't make me laugh. Dude. You got the name? I'll do it for 3,000. What? We're really hurting for help right now. Don't blow this! That money's from Marlene's school. It's her college tuition. 2,000. Thanks, Cloud. You're so sweet. And not at all insufferable. Yeah, I must have blacked out. Had one too many Mountain Dews. All right. Boom, 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 ba 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 Wait, wait a minute, wait a minute, wait a minute, hang on a second. Good morning, Cloud. Did you sleep well? A buried snoring kept me up next to you, wouldn't? I don't know what you- Oh, ho, 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 Marker hands. Are you Okay, Barrett, I'm not sure if you're aware of this, but I think your daughter's back here making a martini or something. What are you doing? Oh, that is not good. However, that seems to be just about the amount of time we have for this episode of Final Fantasy VII. In the next episode, we're going to be talking to Barrett over there, probably going on a mission, and maybe seeing what's up with why his daughter is making a drink back here. So thank you all for watching, and I'll see you guys next time. Be sure to like, comment, and subscribe if you enjoyed this video. Bye-bye.